The word organization can sound daunting to anyone. So why should we take time away from making our art to create an art inventory? Hi, my name is Carrie, and today on Art is Strong, I'm going to talk to you about the many benefits of creating an art inventory and how it helps you and your art. The, the first benefit I see to having and maintaining an artist inventory is you're keeping track of your art. Don't you want to know where it is? Don't you want to remember who's purchased from you? How do you know these things? How do you how do you keep track of any of it? How do you remember what you've made if you don't create an inventory? Two. With an inventory, you're going to know what you actually have for sale. If someone asks you, you can open that inventory really quickly, take a look through it, and tell them what you actually have currently available for purchase. And, you know, tied to this keeping track thing as well, you want to keep track of the names of these people who are, who are purchasing your work so that you can get in contact with them. Because it's actually a lot harder to get the first sale from someone than it is to get the second. So you want to be building quality relationships with your collectors and really making an effort to get to know them. And those are details that you can make note of in an art inventory. You'll know the kind of work they like, and you can give them a little heads up when you have a new piece coming out that might suit their style or their home. Reason number three for you is that you'll know what you have for an exhibition. Some artists actually request in their contracts with people who buy their work that they might take the artwork back for exhibition only. So that's something you could decide you want to do. And if you don't know who has your art or where it is, then how could you possibly collect a bunch of pieces together for an exhibition of sorts? So that's one important way to keep track of that. It also, again, tells you what you have available currently in your studio that's either for sale or for exhibition or both. So all of these details will be readily available to you if you take a little time after each artwork that you complete and put it in an inventory. Put it in an inventory. It's hard to say three times fast. The fourth reason I think you should keep an inventory is you want to maintain a collection of high resolution images for of your art. This is an important thing to have because if at some point you choose to create prints of your art or you're lucky enough to have a book written about your work and yet all the work's been sold, you want to have documentation of that work and the high resolution imagery will be easy for people like printers to use should you want to print your art in a, for a book or individual prints for sale. My fifth reason I believe that an art inventory is important is it helps you document the evolution and growth of your signature style. You find your voice, right? And your voice will change over time. Sometimes when we talk about style, people can feel a little uncomfortable with that idea or nervous that that means they don't have a style if things evolve. But that's completely normal and natural as an artist to have that experience. So when you have an inventory and it's chronological, or through by a series, right? You can look through all of your work in that inventory and see how it's changed, see how things have taken you in new places. And this could really help you create things like your artist statement. My second to last reason I would encourage you to create an art inventory is you wanna keep track of your past, present, and future art. And what I mean by this is look, if you've had work in the past in an exhibit, you're going to note that in the inventory. If you have had work sold to someone of notable influence who's willing for that to be public, that might be something you put on your website or get a testimonial from them. So you want to have all of that information because it's essentially a resume for you. Every time your art's shown in an exhibit or featured in a gallery somewhere, you or even featured online, you want to document that and document it for each individual artwork as it happens. And the best way to keep track of all of that is through your inventory. It, wouldn't it be nice to actually have a track record of all the things going right about your art? So many times I think we focus on everything that's not yet happening. An inventory is actually a celebratory space of all of the successes that you achieve through your art. My seventh and final reason for you today to create and maintain an art inventory is you want to keep track of your pricing. Maybe it's time for you to actually increase your prices. How will you know unless you keep track? And with every artwork you have available or that's been sold, you're gonna note those prices. You're gonna note the size of your work. You're gonna note the medium it's in. You're gonna note where it's been exhibited and who has it. And keeping track of all that information is gonna help you see perhaps 
you've been selling out really fast from all of the work that you have, well, guess what? It probably means that you need to increase your prices and it'll help you do it in a strategic way that honors your collectors while also honors you and brings even increased value to your life because you have more funds to buy more supplies and make more art. Be creatively courageous. Today, in the comments below, I'd like to know how an inventory would help you. What do you think it would give, you know, what kind of benefit would it give you to create and maintain an inventory of your art? How do you think it would serve you? And if you have a system for creating and maintaining an inventory that's really handy, then why not share it in the comments below? Let's spread our wealth of knowledge and give to others. Thanks guys for watching and please share this video if you feel it could help someone else grow with their art. Have a good day.